this will be your story if you resonate with divine masculine energy. So this is going out to my he's, they's, them's that uh, resonate with divine masculine. Uh, you may have been um, going through some type of self-growth, self-focused. You're just very focused on building yourself up, maybe building up your masculine energy, like tapping in to your divine masculine energy. Uh, you may, if you're the divine masculine, you may have been um, distracted with self-growth, really pouring into yourself, not really paying attention to anything else. And um, there may be somebody, okay, the way that this is feeling is that somebody has realized, okay, because there, there's a realization here. So take this as it resonates, whether this is you in the story or this is somebody else, okay, because this could be flip switched reversed just take it as it resonates um anyway somebody was once distracted and now that they've put some time and effort into themselves and their growth and like nourishing themselves and like kind of like soul finding you know what i mean like kind of going on an internal journey here they realized that they were distracted and that um that there was somebody either you or them vice versa, uh, was very devoted to them, and they abandoned this person, okay, someone was extremely devoted, and they're having this epiphany, this realization now, after the fact, okay, um, that somebody was very, like, just devoted, uh, they may also now start craving this person, or craving the love that they once had with this person, um, vice versa, but they're really starting to understand the part that they played and how they abandoned somebody that truly loved them or had abandoned because of the distractions, because of not really knowing themselves inside. Um, they just, they, they abandoned somebody that truly was like on their side, truly was down for them, ride or die type stuff, someone that really actually was devoted to them in a very serious way. Uh, I think that they're starting to realize that they're hoping that maybe somehow, some way, one day, things could actually work out. Now, what could have happened is someone may have been under some form of uh, just like evil eye, other people's opinions, living for other people. There may have been inner demons or battles or some type of spell work, okay? So take this only as it resonates, guys, um, going on here. And that's why they may have felt cursed or they may have felt like things were never going to go in their way or that they were just meant for certain things. And now that they've worked on themselves, they've realized that where they, basically where they messed up, okay? And that um, they really had... They possibly could have had a negative attraction or a fatal attraction with somebody, somebody that may have done spell work or something, but that is being broken. And I think that because this gets broken, they start having these realizations like, ah, crap, they messed up. All right, guys. So um, they just, they're kind of messed up over it. They don't really know how to feel. Um, so if that resonates with you, I'm sorry. I love you. Uh, I hope that you are doing well. And guys, reach out if you 